we must commit ourselves. We shall follow, faithfully follow, carefully follow. We undergird them with our prayers. We undergird them with our support. And we thank you that we believe your hand is upon them. Bless them with good health and strength, sound minds, and, and good judgment that depends upon the leading of you, O oh God. And we bless you for it. So for this next year's time, until we do meet again for this kind of service, we believe these shall be you. We shall pray for them and support them. We believe your will shall be done. We say thank you for that. Thank you again, Lord, as we consecrate ourselves so the Lord receives us and anoints us and uses us to your glory. Love you for it. Amen. Let the church say amen. 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 We praise God again for the pastor of this house and his wisdom. Amen. Praise God. We, know we not want to hear from the president of the IMA remarks, and then we will hear from the preacher of the hour. Amen. Let's hear Thomas. Thomas. Amen. amen. Come on, Pastor Brown. Let's give Pastor Guthridge a big hand, everybody. Great job. Pastor Guthridge, thank you so much, Pastor. Pastor Thomas, did he preach the Lord use you today? Yeah, Lord, come on, give me a big give me a big hand. The Lord used you today. The Holy Ghost was used today. Great job. I have the Holy Spirit to use you in a great way. This is just there to be so, so pleased. Amen. When he called me the other day and told me that uh, he had to go, I said, Pastor, you family. He said, well, Pastor Tom, he's family too. Amen. Amen. We're all in the family together, so we thank God for the word that was given to us, the musician. God bless you, Brother Willis. Thank God for you. Come and give him a hand. All of the church is here with us today. Come on, let's thank God for him. And to Pastor Carl for opening up his door in the first church of God family. Let's give him a hand. Come on. We thank the Lord for him being one of our leading pastors, amen, in our city. And we're so good to have Pastor John Roberts with us as well. Let's give him a hand as well. Thank the Lord for him today, one of our leaders as well. We thank God for both of them. We thank the Lord for you. Thank you, Pastor, for uh, giving us the charge today. It just seemed as though we couldn't get it off the ground due to the weather. And the weather's been challenging us all, even in our church atmosphere, our ties, our membership. We've been dealing with that. We think today was a great day, amen, all over the city. But uh, we want to thank God for you. Brother Sykes is here. He has something that he wants to give to us at this time. Brother Sykes. Amen. 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 English and Ian English and Judge, as yes. we are black elected officials. Please join me. Uh, is there any other elected official in the house? Uh, Therese, Therese uh, Gabriel had to leave, unfortunately. Her mother is 97 years old and in hospice. Y'all, please keep her in your prayers. As they join me, Man, you know what? There's only one thing I've done wrong, and that's stayed in sin a little too long. I should have been to 50 years, because this is a good place to be. recognizing the Black History Program and installation of officers in the denominational ministers alive on Sunday, February 23, 2014. Honoring the International Ministers Alliance Black History Program and installation of the IMA officers in the First Church of God, located on Collingwood Boulevard in Toledo, Ohio. Honoring Reverend Cedric Brock, President, Reverend uh, Dr. Robert Frick, First Vice President, Reverend Dr. Jerry Booth, Second Vice President, Reverend Dr. Otis Gordon, Treasurer, Reverend 
Shirley Sparth Chaplain, Reverend Lee Williams, Executive Secretary, Elder Gina Hickland, Correspondent Secretary, Bishop Randall Parker, Co-Chair, Chaplain, Reverend Chester Trail, Parliamentarian, Bishop Nelson Clark, Sergeant at Arms. Now, therefore, be it resolved by the Council of the City of Toledo that this Black History Program and installation of officers by the Eminent Denomination Ministers Alliance is here remembered and honored for outstanding faith-based service as upstanding citizens of the City of Toledo. City Council members, Steve Steele, Larry Sykes, Michael Craig, Tyrone Riley, Teresa Gabriel, Rob Guzman, Matt Cherry, Jack Ford, Todd Walewski, Lindsey Webb, Sandy Spain. On behalf, would you join me? Uh, well, you can just give it to them. And ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank each and every one of you. It's important to keep us lifted, protect us with your prayers. It was me that won by five votes. God bless you. Everybody, everybody, come on. Amen. And while we're standing, whether in English or in Spanish, come here for a second and you and Valley. Amen. Judge, God bless you. God bless you, Judge. God bless you, Brother. God bless you, Counselor. Thank God for you. This young man in, in English, I, I remember him growing up on Joffrey as a, as a little boy. He uh, was named about, what, 10 years younger than me, what have you. But I remember him playing play football in the neighborhood, what have you. He was always very quiet, very calm. It's like you've seen now, it's the way he was back then. But what I'm asking us to legal to do is to support this young man as he runs for judge. Come on, put your hands together. We want to support this young man as he runs for judge. We don't want to just do it with our hands back. We want to do it on, on, in May when it comes to voting. We want to get out and vote. We want to make sure that this young man, through the politics of the inside, will be able to bypass that because Toledo will stand behind him being a young African-American man aspiring to go higher and higher in the city, the field of civic. His wife is doing an awesome job. Let's give her a hand. Let's go. Let's go for her. We don't want to just give lip service. We want to get behind him and we want to vote for you. You'll see him in certain spots throughout the community. Pastors, let's push him. Let's, if we can, open our doors up, have him come say something to our congregations. And the, the field is wide open. But, brother, the Lord is, is with you and we're praying for you. He belongs to Worship Center with Dr. Patrick History, a great friend of ours, who was one of our advisors. And we thank God for you, all right? In English, don't forget that in English. In English, <laughs> let's say amen. Come in May, when it starts now, we want to help you, we want to build it. Amen. The uh, uh, table for a pink cancer awareness in the back, back here. Let us make sure we go back and support that. Thank you, Pastor Williams, for bringing that to the forefront. Amen. And we want to thank all the city council. We thank you, Brother Sykes, for recognizing us, giving us an opportunity to be seen downtown. Also, we want to thank God for all the pastors who are doing such a great work in our community. I was so honored and so happy to open up the blade and see Pastor Willis, amen, in the paper, and then see Pastor Williams, see Bishop Parker when they ran the school board, to be able to see Pastor Gordon and Pastor Cole and when they put the coalition and Pastor Shepherd and, and be able to see all the other pastors who are doing a great work in this community. Let's give these pastors a great big hand. We thank God for everything that they're doing. The Lord is blessing us. We know we have powers that we are behind the scenes trying to divide us. But we want to stay together as Pastor has given us the charge. And let's stick together because together we stand and divided we do what? Oh. Amen. So let's stick together. But I just thank the Lord for everyone. I'm excited about what 2014 and uh, the next couple of years offers to us. I'm looking forward to our, our, our uh, revival conference coming up. Y'all, we got some of the best preachers in the country coming. We got E. Dewey Smith. Uh, where's E. Dewey Smith? Uh, where's he out of Atlanta, Georgia? Am I right? We also have a uh, pastor out of uh, Chicago. Otis Moss, my God, great preacher. And we have Jamal Bryant out of Baltimore, Maryland. That's a great lineup. That's coming to Toledo. Come on, put your hands together. That's coming to Toledo, Ohio. You see billboards across the city. We're working with our brother Chris Bird and a few others with our music. So you hear about that as we go along. Let's get involved. This is this is a great great accomplishment for us to be able to have that in Toledo, Ohio. Why? Because we got some of the best preachers in the country right here in Toledo. Come on, somebody. This is close. This. We heard a great word tonight. Great word tonight. Amen. And we got to one of the greatest bishops in the world 
Bishop Tisdale. Come on. Tell your neighbor, I'm excited about what God is doing. I'm Amen. I'm excited. I'm excited about what God is doing. I'm going to bring up back Pastor Thomas at this time, and he's going to give us his final remarks and the benediction in that order. God bless you. Amen. God bless you. Let me say before we stand, thank you, uh, President Brock and all the officers, for allowing me to come in my bishop's place. I know he should be getting in the air soon to get to New York. And we want to ask that you would prayerfully cover him while that the plane would take off when it's supposed to, stay up like it's supposed to, and land when it's supposed to. Amen. And so I'm thankful to all of you who were sharing. You were so kind with your responses and your remarks and your smiles. Even if you didn't feel like it, you smiled anyway. So thank you so much. Thank you, friendship. Thank you, City of Zion. Thank you, everybody. Let's stand now. Let me give you my apology. Let me give you my apology. I uh, did not mean to be disrespectful in my presentation. Uh, I realized that there were some children in the room, and I don't want ever to be disrespectful and cause parents to have to re-explain something that the preacher said. And I think you know what I'm talking about. So pray for me. Pray for me, all right? Uh, please tell, tell your children. Thank you so much. I, I really mean it. I really mean it. Didn't mean to be offensive in any way, shape, or form. Thank you so much. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. One more thing. The, the uh, First Church of God Choir, let's give them a hand as well. We appreciate them. The Mountain Leader Choir, we appreciate them in the rest of the friendship. And Pastor Gordon, Pastor Gordon, we want to thank Pastor Gordon for putting the program together. Come on, he had to face a few challenges, but let's appreciate them. Our announcement total was, I think, $1,100. Am I correct? What the seventeen hundred dollars? Seventeen hundred dollars. Give that a hand, somebody. Amen. And the dinner is prepared in the back. We're taking pictures as well for the ministers and the wives. The first lady is in the house. At this house, Sister Cole. Let's give her a hand as well. We appreciate that. All the first ladies are the first men. We appreciate that as well. Amen. Pastor Braxton, why don't you come on up and be with us? We thank the Lord for you. See you sit back, back here. God bless you. All right, we just don't want to forget anyone. Take your name by the hand. We're going down. Father, we love you. Thank you, God, for giving us grace, even when we didn't deserve it. Thank you, God, for allowing us another chance. Thank you, God, for allowing our, as the saints of old used to say, our golden moments to roll on a little while longer. I pray mightily for the president and his staff of the IMA. I pray, God, for every leader that is connected and attached to it. To it. God, that the mission and the mandate that you place on this wonderful organization would grow and would accomplish it by leaps and bounds. Thank you, God, for every hand, even behind the scene, that helps to get it done. That doesn't clamor for the microphone. That doesn't grasp for the gap, but allows their hand to assist and to aid, even if their name is never called. I pray now, God, for the hand we hold right now. God, I press and ask that you would press a fresh grace, a fresh determination, a fresh commitment, a fresh joy as we get ready in a few days to move into the third month of the year 2014. If it's if you give us a chance, God, we are, we will pro we promise to give your name the praise. And so, God, we thank you for tonight. Now, Father, as we get ready to leave this place, but of course, never from your sight. Bless my brother. Bless my sister. Pour out a special blessing and meet every one of their needs according to your riches in glory. In the name of Jesus, we pray and ask it all. And all the people of God said together, amen. God bless you.
about you on camera. Yeah, this is Facebook, say hi Facebook, y'all. Alright, alright. 